It happens every morning. As people wake up and start their daily routines, electricity demand rises. Then, factories, schools, hospitals, and businesses open, driving demand higher. As temperatures rise throughout the day, air conditioning pushes electrical loads even harder. As the day goes on, demand reaches its peak. Then, activity dies down, and electricity loads drop accordingly. And the next morning, the cycle begins again. Things like temperature and weather can affect heating and cooling loads. In many places, average electricity demand doubles in hotter months. So how can we provide power that's reliable and affordable in the face of this fluctuating demand? Let's look at one potential power source, renewable energy. Renewable energy sources are the fastest growing generation technology. They generate no emissions. Their total life cycle cost is competitive because although they are expensive to build, they are cheaper to operate because their fuel sources are free. Renewables intermittent nature, though, creates a challenge for grid operators. The sun provides energy when it's directly overhead, but not if it's cloudy and none after it sets. Similarly, the wind isn't always blowing hard enough for turbines to produce their rated capacity, which creates a challenge, especially since electricity can't be cost-effectively stored in large quantities for extended durations. Utilities and operators must constantly fill the gap between supply and demand, especially as more renewable power is added to the grid. But with natural gas power plants, there's a solution. Gas plants provide the capacity a renewables heavy grid can depend on. They can start or stop quickly, ramping up or down in load as wind or sunlight conditions vary. Natural gas is popular. It currently provides more of the USA's electricity than any other source. It's economical, the most economic generation technology today, with the lowest plant capex of all generation technologies, and it's greener compared to coal plants. While coal plants around the world are being retired and renewables can make up some of that energy, gas plants are still needed to provide dependable capacity. Gas offers 50% lower CO2 emissions than coal, as well as other types of emissions overall. It's small but mighty. Gas plants require 80 times less space to produce the same amount of energy compared to renewables, making a difference in major cities where physical space is at a premium. Their compact size lets them be placed much closer to where power is needed, reducing the need for miles of transmission wires. And natural gas is here to stay. Despite the rapid growth of solar and wind, by 2040, it's expected that natural gas will provide 50% more electricity in the USA than wind and solar combined. At GE, we're focused on building a pathway to a carbon-neutral future. Our gas turbines are already capable of operating on blends of hydrogen and natural gas. In some cases, our turbines, like the 7HA.03, offer a pathway to 100% hydrogen. And since hydrogen is a zero-carbon fuel, this means gas turbines can run without producing CO2. Natural gas plants are playing an important role in the future of power enabling reliable, affordable, and more sustainable energy. Continuing our commitment to the future of energy.